All right, here we go. So we're getting ready to spin. Yay! All right, sub goal redemption voice mod for five minutes. Hey, what's up, YouTube? I'm going to show you how to create that spin the wheel widget I was using, using OBS and my new favorite bot, Firebot. The widget is actually a Streamlabs widget, but if you're like me and you prefer to use OBS rather than Streamlabs OBS, this is how you can do it and still take advantage of some Streamlabs widgets because I think they have some pretty great widgets. So first you're going to need a Streamlabs account. So head over to streamlabs.com, log in with your Twitch account, and once you are logged in, go to all widgets. From here, we're going to scroll down and look for spin the wheel. This needs to be pre-configured. You only need to do it once unless you're changing the, uh, the prize categories on the wheel. So I have mine set up with all of my categories. You can set um, the probability of those categories being chosen. You can set the colors and everything like that. Once you're satisfied with your configuration and the speed of your wheel, you can test it out by copying your widget URL. Do not share this with anybody, but you can copy this into a separate browser tab and then go ahead and click spin the wheel and come over and make sure it looks like you want it to look on your stream. Next, you're going to head over to OBS, find the scene that you want your spin the wheel widget to show up on and highlight that scene and then create a new browser source. Under sources, you're going to hit the plus button, select browser, I'll create new, we'll call it spin. And here you're going to paste in that widget URL. Go ahead and adjust it and size it to wherever you want it to appear on your scene. Now that we have our wheel created in Streamlabs and we have our browser source set up in OBS to show the wheel, we need to go over to Firebot and create the trigger to actually spin the wheel whenever we want it to be spun. So once we have Firebot open, the first thing we're going to do is integrate Firebot with Streamlabs. We're going to go into our settings, integrations, choose Streamlabs. Yours will say link. Mine says unlinked because it's already linked, but go ahead and link that and put in whatever authorization credentials it asks you for. You may need to restart Firebot afterwards, but once that's done under this connections, you'll see an additional connection. You see I'm Twitch connected, overlay connected and Streamlabs connected. In order to run this command, all three of these have to be green. You can toggle the connections on and off like so. So once those are connected and on, now we need to create a command to spin the wheel. So let's go under commands and we will create a new custom command. Let's call it spinner. And we can set who runs this command. I don't want my chat running this command. I want to restrict it to myself as the broadcaster. And so I'm going to add a permission restriction. And this permission restriction will be set on the role of the streamer. Once that's done, let's go back in and finish editing our command. We're going to add a new effect and I'm going to search for the word spin. And as we can see, this will spin the wheel, trigger Streamlabs spin the wheel feature. So let's go ahead and add that. And that's it, we don't need any extra type of effects. So let's go ahead and save our changes. Okay, so now we're ready to test. We're back in OBS and I went ahead and moved my source to my test scene just so all of the other stuff is out of the way. And so we'll go ahead and run our test command spinner. And as you can see, my wheel is spinning. There you have it. If you need any additional help, please feel free to stop by my Discord. I have a streamer tech help channel where I can go into more details as far as setting up Firebot, the integrations, or any other questions you may have about some of these uh, streamer tech subjects. Thanks so much for watching.